Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the channel. A few months ago, we made a video with regards to downloading a view only file on Google Drive. Now, since then, that method has become um, unusable. So we're going to update that and I'm going to show you in this video how you can actually have a downloadable version of the video on Google Drive, which is a view only video. So let's get into it. I'm on Google Drive and we're going to go in here to this very top file and you can see that this is a view only. Once you click on it, you'll actually be able to see. So on the right hand side, we're going to tap on the three dots and go open with and we're going to tap on preview. So as you can see, it's a view only file and I'm using this short video just as an example. But what we want to do is we want to make sure that we are viewing it in full resolution. OK, so you're going to go down to the gear cog on the right hand side. You're going to tap on that. And here you're going to make sure the quality is the highest that you can possibly get. So now what we're going to do is we're actually going to screen record this video and you don't need any fancy screen recording software. I'm going to show you two ways to actually do this. So the first way is actually what I'm currently using now, and that is OBS. All right. OBS Studio is fantastic. It's got tons of settings and you can really customize it to the capabilities of your machine as well as your needs. So as you can see, I am currently screen recording and you can go ahead and you can screen record anything. So what you want to do is you want to go into settings and you want to go and make sure that you're looking for your hotkeys and you want to create a start recording, stop recording hotkey. Okay. Once you have done that, you're going to go out and you're going to jump into your video and you are going to full screen your video and then you are going to start recording and push play. You will now be able to record your video and you'll have a version of your video which you can continue to watch without having to have an internet connection. Now, one of the important things over here is to also, if you have a very long video, you can actually go into the settings and change the playback speed so that it's recording twice as fast. What you're then going to do is when you open your video, just like this, you're going to go ahead and you are going to right click and you're going to look for open with and you're going to look for the Groove Media Player. Now, what happens with the Groove Media Player is it has the ability to have your playback speed faster or slower. So what you're going to do is you're going to go into the three dots at the bottom and you're going to look for speed and you're going to play it half as fast because this will now make your playback the same as what the video originally was shot in. Now, the second way you can go ahead and actually record your screen is going ahead and holding in the Windows button and tapping on G on your keyboard. And this will bring up what we call the Xbox Game Bar. And right in the center, you can go ahead and tap on Capture. And now you can actually record your screen. Again, you can change some settings, including the microphone being turned on. So if you do obviously need audio, that is a good thing. And this will record the audio that is on your device. So it's a digital audio. So you don't have to have your speakers on while you are recording. So there are two ways you can now gain access to a view only video file on Google Drive. If this was helpful, please do drop us a like. We'll see you next time, folks.